Drifting is a very serious problem. If you ask a sailor what is one of the greatest problems that you have when you're anchored, he'll say that what ha ends up happening is we begin to drift away from where we thought we were anchored to. Therefore, we ought to give the more earnest heed to the things which we have heard, lest at any time we should let them slip. A more earnest heed simply means a more frequent application. It means a more frequent application. And the word slip is a nautical term which is used to describe the drift. So therefore, if we don't more frequently apply the things we've heard, we'll drift away from them. And let me give you a little application that a better life is a life where a person is cautious of the drift. One man said this, uh, he said, the man who removes a mountain begins by carrying away small stones. And this is how it is with a Christian. We keep carrying away these little itty bitty stones and we don't realize that we have drifted, we have drifted from where we were anchored. At one point in time, we would say that we were anchored and we, we knew the Word of God, but we drift away from the Word of God one small stone at a time. And this just doesn't happen overnight. It happens a little bit at a time and a little bit at a time. Before long, you realize that, look where I've gotten. I'm all the way over here and I should be all the way over there. As we talk about drifting from the Word, check your anchor. Know where you're anchored. From time to time, get out on the deck and pull on that anchor and say, have I drifted from the Word? Am I getting away from the Word of God? This is the anchor that we have. And when we begin to drift away from the Word of God, we'll have no sure foundation.